Good morning and welcome to Greater Bethlehem Temple Apostolic Church Primary Sunday School class for ages five through eight. I am your teacher, Sister Casey Fisher. Before we get started, let's take some time to tell God thank you. He does so much for us each and every day. So we should always start our day by acknowledging God. Think about your week. How have you seen God show up for you or even someone else? Are you thinking? Do you have something in mind yet? Let's see. Do you have a place to sleep? Someone who loves you. Did he wake you up today? Yes, he did. Okay, so on the count of three, we are going to scream all the way to heaven and say, thank you, Jesus. Are you ready? Let's go. One, two, three. Thank you, Jesus. One more time. Thank you, Jesus. And one last time. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, it is always the right time to give God thanks. Okay, now that we have told God thank you, we are going to let him know what we need from him. God is here to help us. He wants us to feel happy and loved. So, what do you need God to help you with? Do you need Do you need help being patient or listening? God can do that. Think about something just like we did when we were giving thanks. Do you have it? Okay, now hold it just a moment. Did you know that if you take your thanks and add it to what you need from God, it equals prayer? Get that one over. Did you know that telling God thank you plus telling God what you need equals prayer? It sure does. It's that simple. So, all right, let's take our thanks and ask and put them together and pray unto God. Lord, we come to you thanking you for all the things that you have done for us, allowing us to see another day, keeping us safe, blessing our family and friends. You have done so much for us every day. We can't even account for it all. Lord, we also come asking you to help us. We know that without you, we can do nothing. We ask you, Lord, to help us make you proud. Help us be good listeners and obey your word. Use us, God, for your glory and help us to grow closer to you each and every day. We ask all these things in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, boys and girls, now it's time to start our lesson. Lesson seven. Jesus prays for us. This lesson can be found in Hebrews chapter four, verse 14 through chapter five, verse 10. Our golden text can be found in Hebrews chapter four, 
verse 14, and reads, Seeing then that we have a great high priest, Jesus, the Son of God, let us hold fast our profession. Our lesson today will share with us the ways that Jesus is like us, but also different from us. Although Jesus was chosen by God, he was still tempted by the devil, just like we are. Although man gets tricked by the devil and falls into sin, Jesus has never sinned. Man is born in sin and has to ask God for forgiveness. Because Jesus is free from sin, God made him the perfect sacrifice. He died for our sins and came back to life in three days. Jesus made it so that we can go directly to God about our needs. We can pray to God at any time. What did we learn? Man was made in God's image, but there are some differences between God and man. Jesus is free from sin. He cannot be tempted and he lives forever. Jesus connects us to God. He prays for us. Remember, Jesus loves us all. I hope that you enjoyed today's lesson and that you learn something that you can share with others. Join me next Sunday for lesson eight of our winter series, Free in Jesus. This lesson can be found in Galatians chapter five, verse one through 17. Check out our other classes on YouTube. Our junior class ages 9 through 12 with Sister Robin Miller. Our intermediate and teen class ages 13 through 17 with Sister Teray Deloach. And our adult class via Telechurch can be accessed by dialing 917-900-1022, code 4781-4781-POUND every Sunday at 9 a.m. If you would like to participate in the upcoming lesson, please email me at caseysenoviafisher at gmail.com. You can share what you're thankful for or record yourself reading the upcoming lesson's golden text. Next week's golden text can be found in Galatians chapter 5, verse 1. Stand fast, therefore, in the liberty wherewith Christ hath made us free. For upcoming services and events at GBTAC, please visit our website at www.gbtac.org or call the church office at 513 513- Six eight one nine six six five. Until next time, have a blessed week.